okay in this session I am going to tell you about indexing and hashing first we will understand what is an index an index is a access mechanism okay that helps me locate where a record is present okay it gives me the location of a particular record and on the basis of what does it give me the location it gives me the location on the basis of a search key so let's suppose I want to find out the record of an employee whose employee ID is equal to 743 so I would look into the index corresponding to the employee ID is equal to 743 entry and I would find the address where this employee record is stored it would be something like let's suppose this is my index and let's suppose this is my file okay so I would have information in my file right and I would have one value where or rather one record where employee ID is equal to 743 and over here I would have many values like right so my this is my index this is my file so my index for 743 would point to this location it's gonna directly give me the value where the employee whose record is having an employee ID 743 is stored okay now let's look at the factors that determine the quality of index factors for quality of an index okay so first is the access type okay access type would indicate does it actually give me the access to the record that I want or does it take me to a record which is nearer to the record that I want okay then can there can be two cases where I need 743 and my index takes me to 743 okay and there can be another index where we have values like 736 753 724 now in another type of index it can be possible that I need 743 but it takes me to 724 and from there I have to go to 736 and 743 finally reaching my desired record so that is about access type okay next factor is access time how much time does it take me to find my record with the help of index next is insertion time okay whenever a new record is entered in the file then how much time does it take for me to insert the details about this record in the index okay how much extra time does entry in the index cost that is about insertion time similarly we would have a deletion time okay whenever I record whenever I delete a record from my file I would have to delete the corresponding entry from the index as well 
so the time incurred in this process is deletion time the next is space overhead how much space does the index itself does the index itself take in the memory that is about space overhead okay so let's see what are the types of index that we have we have basically broadly two types of index types of index okay one is an ordered index and the other is a hash index okay a hash index is the one which is created via a hash function while an ordered index is the one which is created for a file in which the records are ordered in some particular way and the index itself is ordered with respect to search key values okay here we use the hash function okay let's now first take ordered index okay so let's suppose i have a file in which i have employee ids like this this file is organized with respect to the employee ids okay but just understand one thing here it is very much possible that this organization is not physical but logical okay a logical organization would have pointers so 123 would point to next value which is 234 and 234 would point to 432 432 would again point to 432 then 432 would next go to 456 456 now would go to 653 653 guy goes to 729 and finally 729 guy goes to 789 and 789 let's suppose is the last entry so it is none okay so this is my ordered file over here ordered or sequential file okay a sequential file does not necessarily have to be physically sequenced okay and suppose so these were my employee ids okay let's suppose we also have pan numbers okay i have pan numbers okay so this is this indicates my pan number so this is my file 
which is having two attributes all the records are having two attributes just for the sake of simplicity so i would have an index i would have an index which is going to have values like 234 say since this is an ordered index the value in the index would be sorted so first we have 123 then we would have 234 we would have 432 okay then we have okay we would have only one 432 what do we have next we have 456 then we have 653 and we have 729 and 789 okay and my index would store a pointer okay so it's going to be something like 123 would point to this record 234 would point to this record 432 would have let's suppose two pointers okay first pointer would point to this record and second pointer would point to this record then 456 would point to this 653 would point to this 729 pointing to this and 789 pointing to this record so this is my index that was based on employee id okay similarly i can have one more index which is based on let's suppose my pan card okay so here i would have values like 3106 what is next 4321 what is next okay it's not going to be 4321 it is going to be Four three okay it is going to be four three two one no it's going to be four two one six then we are going to have four three two one okay then I am going to have seven one five three seven one five three seven one six three and seven two seven three and seven five six seven seven two seven three and seven five six Seven. Okay. Let's suppose this is another index. Okay. And I say this is based on based on what? Pan numbers. And this also would point to three one zero six would point to three one zero six. Four two one six would point to this. Four three two one would point to this, and we will just complete it. Okay, I won't show it. I would just show the partial pointers. Okay, let's assume it is pointing to appropriate record. So in such a case, I call the employee id index as primary index why because a index which is created on the basis of attribute value which is used to sequentially arrange the file is known as a primary index primary index is an index which is based on an attribute value used to sequentially arrange the file 
ओके सो दिस इज माय प्राइमरी इंडेक्स एंड माय पैन नंबर इज अ सेकेंडरी इंडेक्स ओके इंडेक्स विच इज नॉट अ प्राइमरी इंडेक्स ऑब्वियसली इज गोइंग टू बी अ सेकेंडरी इंडेक्स द एट्रीब्यूट फॉर अ सेकेंडरी इंडेक्स इज नॉट यूज टू सिक्वेंशियली अरेंज द रिकॉर्ड इन द फाइल राइट सो वी हेव सीन वॉट इज अ प्राइमरी इंडेक्स वन मोर थिंग प्राइमरी इंडेक्स इज ऑल्सो कॉल्ड एज अ क्लस्टरिंग इंडेक्स ओके राइट 